Hello, my name is Billy Trimbo with Cisco Tech. Today we're going to be discussing core dumps on IAM and Presence. A core dump is the file created when a service terminates unexpectedly. The core dump file can be analyzed to produce a report of the processing threads that were active at the time of the core. This information is what developers need to determine if there's a bug in the software. TAC engineers can also use the Analyze Core file to find any known possible defects. In order to do this, we'll need a command line interface, as you can see here. To get a list of the core dump files, we will start with a command utils core active list. I have quite a few core files. In most cases, you'll want to pick the one that matches the date and time the core occurred. However, I'll pick the one on the bottom and highlight it to copy it to my clipboard. To analyze the core dump we need to use another command utils core active analyze and then paste the file to the end. Now we'll press enter and we'll get a prompt asking if we're sure that we want to do this because it may tax the system. This isn't usually a problem, but if you are concerned, make sure that you're doing this at a convenient time. The command analyzes the core and prints out the results on the screen, as you can see. You can escape out of that, or you could go ahead and print out the rest of the contents of the core. I'm going to print out the rest of the contents so we can see what that looks like. At this point, you have two choices. If you printed out the entire contents of the analyzed core file like this, you can then highlight it and drop it all into a notepad. Or if you set up logging in putty, it will do that for you. Your other option is to send the file to a TFTP server. You do that with a file get command. But first, let's use another command file list active log core analyze this command will obtain the list of our analyzed core files and of course in this case we just have the one now we can just use the up arrow to get our last command and then just make a change to file get and then at the end we can put the name of the analyzed core file just fill out the rest of this and the file can be transferred to your TFTP server These files are just a small analyzed version of the actual core dump that will be hundreds of megabytes or larger. Now that you have this analyzed core file, you can send it into TAC. And that's all there is to working with core dump files on IAM and Presence. Thanks for watching.